Hello and welcome to another episode of MobilesTechLand.com. Today I'm going to show you how to bypass Samsung account from Samsung G920F Binary 6 also known as Reactivation Lock. Sorry I could not show you step by step as a video because I was trying to process several times and it happened suddenly so I could not record. So I'm going to show the process step by step so please stay with me till the end. Please do not miss any process so you will not be able to unlock it. Firstly you will have to hard reset your Samsung device. After hard resetting you will see this image. Just to confirm this phone had reactivation lock on. Now the tools you will need is a Z3X Samsung Tool Pro. Any version will do but it has to be after version 25 which means any version after version 25 will work. You need to flash this phone with combination file. To get the combination file go to frpbypass.co.uk and download Samsung account bypass binary 6. When you click on this you will download the zip file. Inside the zip file you will have the combination file binary 6. You will have the full ROM flash file binary 6. Moving on you need to open the Z3X Samsung tool and choose your model and flash the combination file. Make sure you untick everything apart from sboot and flash the file. After you flash the file, your phone will either be stuck on Samsung logo with some green writing on the top or it will go to the main home screen. Now put the phone in download mode. Go to Z3X Samsung Tool Pro and select the model G9531F not G920F. This is the trick where reactivation is taken out of this phone. I have tried several times with G920F and failed but selecting this model G9531F did the trick. Go to unlock tab and click the reset frp slash react slash ee. When the process is complete, take the phone to download mode again. So this is where I had finally done it. Now since the phone is out of reactivation lock, we will now flash the phone with full firmware. The firmware is one which we downloaded previously, not the combination, the full file. Now go to Z3X Samsung Tool Pro and flash the phone with the full firmware. Once the firmware is loaded, click the flash button and flash the file. Let the file flash completely and then it will take you to the welcome screen. Complete the setup and then your phone should be on the main home screen. This process will only work with binary 6. If you have a different binary, you will have to download a different binary combination file. So that's pretty much it for today. Thanks a lot for watching. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. Bye bye.